What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Nerd Realm. I'm Kyle the Wanderer, and on today's Card Vault series, I'm going to show you the Pokemon card from Base Set Unlimited. Number 49, Drowsy. So, without further ado, let's reveal the card. So there it is, the Pokemon card Drowsy from Base Set Unlimited. Now, you can see in the top left corner of the card that this is a basic stage Pokemon card. Pokemon cards are the main cards used in the game to battle your opponents. Basic Pokemon cards can be put into play directly without any requirements. Below the stage title, you have the title of the card which in this case is Drowsy. In the top right corner of the card, you have the Pokemon's HP or hit points, which in this case is 50. Next to that, you have the symbol of the Pokemon's energy type, which in this case is Psychic. Below that, you have the card illustration. We'll take a closer look at that in a moment. Below the illustration, you have some Pokedex data. Drowsy is a Hypnosis Pokemon. Its average length is 3 feet 3 inches. Its average weight is 71 pounds. Below the data, you have the Pokemon's attack moves or abilities. Drowsy's first move is Pound. The attack does 10 damage, and the requirement to use the attack is 1 colorless energy. Drowsy's second move is Confuse Ray which states, flip a coin. If heads, the defending Pokemon is now confused. The attack does 10 damage, and the requirement to use the attack is 2 Psychic Energy. Underneath the moves on the left side, you have the Pokemon's weakness, which in this case is Psychic. In the center, you have the Pokemon's resistance, which in this case, Drowsy doesn't have a resistance. On the right side, you have the Pokemon's Retreat Cost, which in this case is 1 Energy. Below this, you have the Pokemon's Pokedex Entry, which reads as follows. Puts enemies to sleep, then eats their dreams. Occasionally gets sick from eating bad dreams. After that, you have the Featured Pokemon's Current Level, which in this case is Level 12. Next to that, you have the Pokemon's Pokedex number, which in this case is Pokedex number 96. Down in the right corner is the card set number, which is number 49 out of 102. Next to that, you have the card rarity symbol. The circle represents a common card. To the left of the set number, you have the copyright information, which is owned by Nintendo, Creatures, and Game Freak and the card is made by Wizards. To the left of the copyright, you have the Illustration Artist. This card was illustrated by Ken Sugimori. Speaking of the illustration, let's take a closer look at it now. The illustration features drawn artwork of a bipedal yellow and brown taper-like creature. The Drowsy has a yellow, sideways oval-shaped head. At the top of Drowsy's head are two small, yellow, triangular-shaped ears with brown interiors. The top of Drowsy's head slopes downwards to its short and small yellow trunk. On Drowsy's trunk are three horizontal wrinkle lines. The trunk curves upwards, merging into Drowsy's small, smirked mouth. Above Drowsy's mouth is a small, squinty, white eye with a black pupil. There are curved lines around the front and back of its eye, giving Drowsy a tired look. The Drowsy has a round, egg-shaped body, with the upper half being yellow, which is then separated by a wavy line, and the bottom half being brown. Drowsy has two rounded, short brown legs with small, brown, flat feet. Each foot has two yellow pointed toes. The Drowsy has two short yellow arms with each hand containing three pointed fingers. 
In the illustration, the drowsy's arms are extended outwards in front of it, with its hands and fingers turned downwards. Surrounding drowsy is a thin purple aura. The drowsy is standing on a background that consists of a swirl of colors of red, blue, and black in a kaleidoscope style. The illustration gives the impression that the drowsy is performing a psychic attack. Perhaps the move Confuse Ray, which is a move on the card. And there you go. That about wraps up our up-close look at the Pokemon card Drowsy from Base Set Unlimited. Stay tuned for the next card in this Card Vault series presented by the Nerd Realm. So, what are your thoughts on this card? And did you ever own a copy of this card? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. And if you'd like to see more, please hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so you can be notified when new videos are live. These simple actions will help to greatly support this channel. If you'd like to help support this channel to grow even more, visit my Patreon page at patreon.com slash thenerdrealm where you can receive exclusive benefits such as early access to videos and more. And if you'd like to get your hands on your own Pokemon cards, visit my web store, trainermerch.com, where we have thousands of Pokemon card singles and codes, and every purchase helps to directly support this channel. Check out these next videos on the screen. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep it nerdy.